Hey! How are you doing today? I hope you're having a gorgeous day so far. My name is Sarah Labar and today is Wednesday, which means it's time for me to show you something crafty. I can't sew today because we've been having water problems and I'm fresh out of clean fabric, but I still gotta film something. I have no idea when I'll be actually using that footage, but I am showing you my everyday Victorian hairstyle. I have actually been wearing that as a protective hairstyle because when I wear my hair in a ponytail the hair elastic tends to break the hair that it's pulling onto and that's the hair around this part of the head which tends to cause a lot of baby hair sometimes it gives me like a great puffy halo around my face I hate it so I've been using that hairstyle as a way to avoid having to put this section of the hair into the rubber band for this hairstyle I need a comb I need a bit of water a brush two hair bands and a few bobby pins all right first step I'm gonna give my hair a good brush I got my hair all brushed out Next I need to make a center part from about the top of my hair to the front I'm using my comb for that Alright I got a nice center part. Next, I need to section off the front part of my hair like that. So I'm simply using my comb and I'm tracing a line as straight as I can make it to the top of the ear, like the top back of the ear, let's say. It doesn't have to look 100% neat, especially if you're wearing it at home. Of course, if I'm going outside or for a special occasion, I am gonna make an effort to make it as neat as I can, but if it's just for everyday wear, meh. So I wanna section off my other front part. I'm gonna try to make it as symmetrical as I can with the other side. Um, so I'm starting... Ooh, white hair. <laughs> I'm starting, uh, yeah, about here at the top and I'm going straight down. Oh yeah, nice. <laughs> Good enough. <laughs> so I'm just gonna tie it off with a bobby pin for now. And I'm gonna take the rest of my hair and tie it in a ponytail. You can either make it a low ponytail or perhaps in the middle. You can make it a high ponytail as well if you wanna, but I personally prefer it to be about in the middle of my hair. So I'm simply tying this off in about the middle of the head. Need to braid this whole bit. I'm taking this second rubber band and I'm tying the end of my big braid and I'm rolling my braid like so and then secure it with a couple of bobby pins. I need about three or four bobby pins to hold the bun. Next, I'm gonna take one of my sides and spray it with a bit of water, like so, and I'm smoothing it. I can also use my comb to smooth it over, like so. You want to smooth it towards the bottom and the front. You're gonna want to smooth your hair towards this point here, in front of the ear. When it's all smooth, you can divide it in three. 
and braid it as well. So you see all the baby hair and all the front hair, instead of being grabbed and pulled and broken by a hairband, it'll be all protected inside this braid. Once you get at the bottom, you're not gonna tie it. Instead, you're gonna bring it back towards your bun. So you wanna bring it this way under the ear and then towards the back of the head. You're gonna want it to lay on top of the little bun here. Well, my hair is curly, so it wants to kind of roll around the bun. So I just tuck it where it wants to lay and then I'm taking a bobby pin and I'm pinning that braid in place, like so. I'm gonna do exactly the same thing for my other side. Take your bobby pin, put it, secure that little braid on top here. I always like to finish my look with a bit of eyebrow pencil. It's the only makeup I wear every day because I feel like it defines my face. It gives it, I think, a bit of character. So I'm just putting a bit of eyebrow pencil. There you have it, my everyday finished Victorian look. It's got the almost genuine Victorian hairstyle and it's got the eyebrows. It's a very practical hairstyle, it's a protective hairstyle, it's neat. It also feels very clean and professional when I have to show myself in public or on the internet. So you have the center part and the side parts here. You have the braids that go down around the ear on the sides and then they loop around this pretty little braided bun here. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel and turn on the notifications for more crafty time with me. Check out my Instagram at Regina. In the meantime, please drink plenty of water, please take care of yourself, please be kind to yourself. And I will see you next Wednesday! Bye!